told them to shut up. But you see, they were not lying. Anyone can tell you to shut up and don't call the name of the Lord when everyone
Then I hope we have a few from Living with Family Ministries and Pastor. Church, amen. We welcome you, sir. Amen. 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 So, we want to thank you and we want to welcome each and every one of you. Repentance. That was one of the key aspects of our getting together, was we as pastors to repent before one another. And to seek forgiveness from, from one another for what we may have said. You know, sometimes you do not know somebody. Going on for, for so long. So, the Bible tells us is to forgive. We have to repent before one another. Amen. Heavenly Father, we thank you. We're going to come before you then to cut the body of Christ down. We confess our sins. our tongue to create this open the hearts of our sheep to forgive begin to do the work in us and clean us We know that you can that you clean us by peace. all those things that are not. Because we know that you have begun the work of God. 
to come to you with broken and contract we understand dear Lord that you want to cut away We are of a broken and a and here with broken and a contrite heart, dear God. Because we already laid the foundation with the chief cornerstone where all of us are the building blocks. to build us back again. And wonder and we can see something great in our lives as we've crucified ourselves, as we've humbled ourselves. Death and life are in the power of the tongue. And sincere. Of all hearts. this afternoon and we just humble ourselves again before you even in the presence of the from this day forward we will acknowledge you in all of our ways as leaders so that we not we would not be lifted up in our own self this afternoon so that we because we have not walked in times God that we have separated ourselves because of our We will be peacemakers, our Father God, that He will be of that Lord God, you will be in everything that we do, God, if you just want us to listen for. We 
we will do that without question. I thank you, God, for giving us repentant hearts. Oh, God, hearts of repentance, Lord God, that we will not continue to carry out from day to the congregation this afternoon for even our Lord. Before you that from now again, I shift the mind of the body of Christ, God, that our hearts will burn us every time there is something wrong, God, that we won't. We have been up for our brothers. We have pulled them down. Through some difficult times. declare what the word declares. That we will speak truth. We will speak what is right. What is lovely. What is that you have not given us a spirit of fear but of love. Rejoice with our brothers and our sisters. Father, we rejoice with each other. God bless you, but we declare that our mind. Of our minds. We pulled up our God every and we declare today, Father, as a congregation. And this 
And so, God, today I pray. I pray, Father God, at every place that we need. I pray that you would pour. Us, you and all that you are saying and all that you are doing. So, God, we thank you that we are available. Father, for you to turn this thing around. We thank you, God, that you purge us like this. God, we look to you for you. We
and your blessing upon them even now. In this difficult time, I pray, O oh God, you'll give them favor in all they are doing. you all remember Pastor Weeks or another pastor who was with us in prayer. I don't know if he's here today, but we have forgotten him in the first go around. And we welcome all of you pastors who are here in addition that you will join us in this time of restoration. For this is, is a And verses, uh, verses 9. Every yoke. Is it not to deal your bread? your own flesh. Then, and the Lord shall guide you continually. And sinners of the breach, the restorer of parts to dwell in. Believe in God for these positive results. as pastors and churches as, and this is a great big uh, let's connect together we're going to pray Grab somebody between, feel somebody warm, let us pray. Hallelujah. Father, you declare in your word that we should be called the repairers of the breach, the restorers of parts to dwelling. This is the hour. Our pastors stand here in your presence. 
us to intercede, not only for those who are here, but for all the pastors in St. Thomas Virgin Islands. As the pastor Leonard has seen the vision and has called us together, even though those who are not here in this place today, we stand in agreement. We stand in the gap for them. And we in the sea for restoration. Father, first. In our churches, my kingdom come. Other times. For the remnant that remains. and the money here and the money That was a conquer worm. And the power worm has eaten. You rose of a man who said, Let us do. And came together. So it's what 
the spirit of one unity in heaven and in You are the, the, the picture. for different religion and your company because we thought because I said I am here to make a difference. Somebody said, mm -hmm. So they're going to see what's happening to the guy with his church around the, the road. Somebody said, mm -hmm. Somebody said, God is unifying his church. I take a winter to a, to a church and they call me during a carnival time. I'm not down, down in that, but it was on a carnival, and I said, these people called me to preach on a carnival. When I went down to the church down in First Street, I'm ministering to these people, the wind of the Holy Spirit blew in the place, and I prayed for the, the, the man of God, and uh, he took the lectern, and he began jumping. You got to watch what you say about your brother down there. Okay, I hear the house up in here. God is doing something. Come on, so God is doing something. And God is up to something. And so therefore, the ear, it doesn't say, I want to be the eye, and the eye doesn't say, I want to be the toe. And the Folks who are toes want to be the head. Folks who are just fingers, they want to be the head. I can't hear the house up in here. Yeah. Folks just drunk through the, the, uh, the, the, the house. They want to be the one to give all the rules and the orders. But in God's house, and you got to function as God wants us to function. Somebody say hallelujah. hallelujah. It's about time. This is a, is a time. This is the age of the When we were out to do business, I remember we had a tent over up over in Bogoni, and there were so many. St. Thomas and John church of the church was together and we went to Lionel Robert Stadium.
I, I didn't know him that well. I said, where he came from? He said, mm, right here. Up here. Somebody say hallelujah. I use Baptist, but you can preach. Somebody say he can turn the house. So I remember them days when we didn't have to bring in the more time than the folks in Carnival. Come on, somebody said we got more time. Months of activities, but we got all the from, we have more time than the Carnival folks. Money to go from go, go to the next level, grade level. We gotta come together, build. I can't get a house up in here. Oh yes, I feel God. But I tell you, we gotta do things differently. Listen, when when God begins to. Say, church rooms don't have enough space and a lot of you
We are the carriers. We are the carriers of this fire. from God, where God want to take these little big things, just where, you know, listen to where God want to take us. That's basically what it is. God giving us a glimpse of where he wanted to take us. That means that God speaking to his people and telling them, here is where we want to take you. Now it's based upon obedience, if based upon obedience, we don't 
tongues and you prostrate yourself before Because you have come before me and I forgive your sins and I'll bring to you a new begin to worship and call upon me. There's a new form of worship. We begin to bud full. Of worship. You begin to flow spontaneously in, in your different churches. Because you've come together. Right now in this place. If you're full with the Holy Ghost, you must feel the fire. And if you feel the fire, no problem. We light you. And, and because the fire is lit, the Holy Spirit says, every time we come together, That's for the Lord God say. Was to come together and worship the Lord. It will be a different experience. Only in your house. But when we come together, it's going to be a new level of my glory. Be the sick has been healed. Healing come to marriages. Bondages are broken. I speak today. The Holy Spirit says, today is the beginning of months to you. And let the prophets judge. Of the Father and the Son, and souls coming out of the piles of hell. God, we believe in hell. God, save us, O oh God. That out of this unity will forge, Lord God, your communities over, over, over the Red Lake District areas. Is a 
is a medium church in Africa. And so, Father, every stop. And we come to you pray. And we have a prophetess, She Sharon. of bewitchment that caused lies to flee agreement. We prophesy agreement. Apostle, the pastors, the teachers. 
church. He needs the prophet and the evangelist. It's not about me, it's about the voice of the Lord. And then God put bread in his church. Hallelujah. The decree declared the love of Christ. It's seen in us this evening. We decree and declare the joy of God is seen in us. We decree and declare that we speak as the voice and the oracles of God in this hour. Increasing in wealth. We prophesy wealth. We prophesy resources. Hallelujah. We prophesy. That should be an every week, not just no, not just two weeks. If we're not praying, I believe that Peter did. Jesus, when he came down off the mountain of transfiguration while he was up there, the man went to Jesus and said, We What kind of 
spirit we up against. It can't happen unless you fast and pray. Amen. Paul and Silas. Midnight hour of your life. It's midnight in your situation. It's midnight in your circumstance and you need to pray. Been for the would I be for the Lord? I'm normal thing. Wasn't nothing for fifteen, twenty churches to come together. that God this afternoon that God hears and the name of Jesus that name which is above all names yeah. Yeah. that been given a mild man under heaven whereby we must be saved by at Faith Christian Fellowship Church Alive in Christ in Hidden Valley, which is now Pound Valley, to give you thanks tonight, oh God. And Lord, today I thank you that the Father, let it begin. Let this fire catch from, as the man of God said, fire catches and it catch from the east to the west to the north or the south. Burn it away. That looks like looks like but are not really a uh, uh, real denomination that lift up and Lord we thank you today Lord that you you are alone is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we can ask or think Father we pray today that the church will come into the unity of the faith unto that perfect, that perfect, perfect hell shall not prevail against you. And Father, I thank you. I thank you for the vision. I thank you for those who have humbled themselves, oh God, and, and, and realize that we all, you made us one. You washed us from our sin in your blood. And Lord, you present us to your Father as kings and priests. Tonight, oh God. And Lord, we pray that, Father God, when they leave this place tonight, they, it will be like that fire Jeremiah shut up in their bones. to tell somebody when we come together they our young men and our young women will no longer In our neighborhood, we will no 
also said if we were God any could be in our homes God would Lord, speak, Lord. Speak to your people. Every pastor. Which you give them oversight over, Lord. Lord, speak to their heart. Teach them, Lord, that they would walk in. Isaiah was sent to Hezekiah. Tell Hezekiah to set his house in order. For he just turn. Just you and me, Lord. <laughs> in the midnight hour. Lord's Supper, we come together showing that reason and reason. Amen. Verse 20, you following me? When you come together, therefore, into one place, that is not Everyone takes it. What? How do you? 